from Sudhanshu. In this video, I will showcase how you can use Gemini, that is Gemini from Google on your personal gmail.com account. First of all, you will have to go to this URL that is one.google.com. I am subscribing this URL in the description and mentioning it in the description for you to go there and subscribe directly. Once you are on this URL that is one.google.com, you would have to go on to the plan section and from the plan section, select the plan which has Gemini Advanced, Gemini in Gmail, Docs and more. Click on this functionality to see that it is applicable in slides and other services as well. That is your Google Meet and Slides is also included. You can also search out other services. So you will have to subscribe for this service that is all AI Premium. AI Premium 2 terabyte plan. The space is available is 2 terabyte. Once you are there, once you've paid for it by clicking on the current plan or subscribing for it, or either you can go to the settings section from the upper right corner. And from here you can upgrade or downgrade the services or your current plan. Change the plan. I would subscribe to the AI premium plan. If you scroll down, you will find other options. See all benefits, see all benefits. From here, you can subscribe to the most appropriate plan that is suitable for you. Once you've chosen the plan, now I will showcase how you can use it in Gmail. That is, you once you've enabled and purchased and refreshed by using the F5 key, you would see a pop-up. Pop-up that allows you to mandate that you will be using Gemini. And once you are allow, uh, approve it, then you would find it in the compose section with the pencil sign over here help me write feature let's try it out mm, write leaf application due to marriage wait for it to enter the data and here it is you can click on the insert button your email is ready You can send it to anyone. Make few changes as per your requirement. And send it. This is how you enable it within the docs.google.com. If you have to see it in the slides as well, that also is possible. Go on to the nine dots and go on to the other documents that is slides.google.com once you are on this URL you can go on to the other services and view it like this is the pop-up that you will get make your images pop in the slides with the background now here I will type um, create slides for school waiting for it to generate the slides it could take about 20 seconds as it is shown over here it takes a little while for the images to get generated you can again specify the type of images that you want to expect once you've done that it will show the images relevant to the subject line that you have mentioned okay Let's have these as the series. Okay. Duplicate slide. We can have this as the background, one for this one. And then for new slide, we'll have this one. And then for the other slide, we can have this one or probably this one. We can delete this out here. Okay. Fill text with school station letter. So if you are figuring out how will you get the text for these speaker notes or for the implementation on the slides, you can go on to the docs section 